Hi everyone, hope you guys are doing good. Today, you know, we'll just make a beaded tree. And to make this tree, I'm actually using crystals, uh, something like glass crystals, which are of different colors. Uh, and I'll be using a floral cord and a floral wire to make a tree out of this. And this would be a cute, fancy decorative item on one of your shelves. And uh, the required materials for this project are crystal beads and you may require a floral cord and uh, this is to make branches and you'll uh, require uh, a wire this is used to attach all these flowers and leaves to this cord and you'll require a small flower pot um, this is uh, usually used to place the tree once we are done with the project and you will require any filling material inside this i'm actually using model magic you may actually use clay or anything that you want and you would need a scissors or any wire cutter so let's begin the project now first you have to unwind the cord and then you have to make a skeletal structure of the whole tree so that you know you can just fix leaves and flowers onto this so just unwind the whole cord And then try to make a base just folding it here and there and now what will I do after I want to just make a tripod stand so I'm just using it like this and now I would just go like this to make another leg of the stand. And then just fold it. So that you will have a base. And now from here we will actually start on to make branches. This will be the tripod stand on which the tree is going to stand and now we have to start with the branches so here comes the first one just fold it like this and then the other one you can just go down right I'm just making a branch um, right opposite to this branch I made it here and then you have to progress to the upper branches and just twist it the smaller the better And then the opposite one for this. Here I'm just making four branches on the main stem so that the center of balance is restored. totally made six stems and after this I am just going down and winding the whole branch over here I mean the main the main stem Uh, you have to take a small cord and then uh, we are just making a leaf out of it. So I will use a small bead and a big bead. So when we put these two together it gives a leaf kind of appearance. 
So what would I do is I would just insert the big bead into the middle and then I would just insert a smaller one on top of this. Now what would I do is I would just bend this like this, turn it around. and then fix the bigger one inside now we have a leaf ready and we have to make ample number of leaves to make this flower you will require a cord which is about 4 inches in length and then you have to take 5 beads to make the petals and I am just choosing a red color here and you will also need a contrasting color to make the center of the petal so I am taking blue here what you have to do is you have to just bend it like this and put these five beads inside five and in the end you have to attach this tinier bead just leave an inch distance above and then make a round and just pull it closely and now here you have to just twist it around and then you have to just pull this one and then just fix it here so that it makes a flower for us here you have to just you know make it pass through the cord just twist it around like this and then just fold this inside as this is a metal wire you can just pop this up so that you'll have a complete flower in your hand and for this we have one two three four five six seven seven branches so we will require seven flowers for this tree today i made flowers of different colors over here now we have to fix flowers and leaves onto this tree so i'm just taking this first one and i'm just inserting this inside this uh, round over here and then I am just twisting it around and fixing it firmly to this branch I am just twisting it I am fixing another flower in the same way Just pull it tight, twist it around so that it settles on the cord. Now we have to fix leaves on this plant. So we are just taking one and then we are just twisting it in the same way. And we are just trying to make a knot kind of thing in the end so that it stays firm on this one. We just made it like this in the past so I'm just twisting this one around so that uh, these beads would stand on this one um, on this cord initially and then they would stand on here so I'm again just twisting them and kind of putting a knot in the end this is the final step you have to fix all leaves over here and then you have to take a small flower pot and then I'm just taking this uh, modeling material and I'm just stuffing it inside first you have to stuff a little bit inside and then you have to make the stand penetrate into this mold 
can you see that it sits in the pot this had just it here and there and then see the uh, see that the center of the balance was restored and now depending on that you have to put additional material be careful and do it slowly so that it stands still just wrap it around so that's how we would do it and now let's fix all the leaves here This is how it would look once it is done. So I think you really like this and I hope you will make something like this. Uh, let me know if you have any questions on this and please do subscribe if you like my videos and thanks for watching this video.